Hello and a warm welcome to Festival TV. My name is Phil. We quite often come across the challenge of cutting deep section timbers not only to length but also cleanly and accurately to ensure that the next process can be carried out. But with Festival we have an answer to this type of challenge and this comes in the form of the sword saw, the SSU 200EB and it means that I can cut these deep section timbers accurately and also quickly. But we can combine this machine working with the guide rail system for Festool and I can work even quicker because I can work with the FS rapid clamp onto the timber. So across here is a pencil line already at 90 degrees and now I can position the guide rail in place. And now we can put the machine into position. So, working with the sword saw, we can also rip timber, and this means we can cut a tenon. So the mark on the left hand side will give me an indicator of exactly where the chain is, even though I may be working on the right hand side. So now we can look at the machine slightly closer. The sword saw works with a sequential operation switch, so I can push down on here and then the switch can be used and then the machine will start up. But also the sword saw can be used for different types of applications and I may need to change the chain. So we can undo this cover here and then the chain can easily be changed. But for a lot of cuts, the sword also needs to be swung back to an angle. And I can use this lever down here and then the angle can be chosen. The big advantage of doing this is that it means that the chain isn't hitting the timber dead on 90 degrees. It's at a slight angle, so it's stroking the timber away rather than having the pressure up against the timber. And with the chain, this needs to be oiled. And we can fill the oil up in this position, but I can also see exactly how much oil is on the machine while I'm using it. And this helps to lubricate the chain, but also reduces any friction on the machine while I'm working, and then the chain will last for a longer period of time. And the chain, on the on the, the chain will stretch after a while, but with this adjustment here, I can then tighten the chain so we can adjust it to make sure we have exactly the right tension on the chain to improve the quality of the cut when we need to. The amount of oil that goes onto the chain can be adjusted here and of course speed control, really important for many different types of applications and this can be adjusted with this wheel here. But not all applications are at 90 degrees and with the sword saw it means that we can also adjust this for any angle cuts as well. So we can undo the screw at the back and also the one at the front. And now we can take the sword saw over up to 60 degrees and also, of course, any angle in between. So it has a wide variety of applications that the machine can be used for. With the red marks along the front here, this gives me exactly the curve line of the chain while I'm cutting. So I know exactly where the left and the right hand side of the chain is positioned during the cut. And because we can work on the guide rail system, it also, I can also adjust the sword saw to make sure it's running true to the, guide rail, to the guide rail while I'm working. And this gives me a really good quality straight cut. So the sword saw can be used not just for cutting timber to length, but we can also rip timber as well, which means we can cut a tenon, for example. And with the sword saw, it also gives me an indicator of where the chain is on the right-hand side, even though I may be working on the left-hand side. And with the mark in this position, it means that I can stop the machine exactly where my pencil mark is to ensure that the shoulder line is correct for both of the two cuts. 
So working with a sword saw for this type of application is really simple, but a sword saw can also be used for other applications as well. And the next videos will also show you how you can work with this machine. So thank you very much for watching, and I hope this has helped your understanding of working with a machine such as a sword saw, and I'll see you again next time.